Gambit's American Buffalo is coming back to Broadway. This time with Sam Rockwell, Lawrence Fishburne, and Darren Criss leading the way as the three men who get all caught up in greed, loyalty, and the search for the American dream. I have wanted to be a part of this place since it came out in the 70s uh, when Robert Duvall did it. I had just finished working with him on Apocalypse Now and I just remember hearing about how great it was when I came home to New York and ever since then I've actually wanted to, to do this play. I think it's moving, I think it's electric and I think seeing these guys doing it is going to be something else. Plus it's in Circle in the Square which is basically like a boxing ring. I mean you're right in the room with them so that's extraordinary. I think it's going to be a great experience for everybody, not only the audience, but for us because, you know, it is a really contained play that seems almost too natural to have it yeah. be like this voyeuristic experience because it's just, there's an intensity of the show that lends itself really well to being inside this smaller space, so that's going to be really cool. One of the great things about the play is that there's a timelessness to it, there's a timeless quality to it, that it speaks to you know, these themes of business and money and betrayal and friendship and these things. Thematically, what the play is dealing with in terms of the American dream, how we pursue getting a piece of the pie in this country, themes of loyalty and friendship. There's a lot of stuff in this play about kind of father-son relationships and compassion and how that balances with trying to get a piece of the pie. You know, sometimes when I see a great play, I get in a fight with somebody I'm with, I, or not a fight, but like a discussion, dispute, debate, shall we say. Yeah, we want people Although, to walk away talking about things, talking about what they've experienced, yeah. talking about how the play relates to situations in their lives and what's going on in the world today. I mean, that's really it.